go out to Atlanta, Georgia, and talk to our good friend Adam. Adam, how are we doing, my man? Doing very well. How about yourselves? Outstanding. How can we help, man? Well, I got a question. I've been fairly familiar with y'all's show with Dave Ramsey. I mean, been starting to listen to those YouTube videos for past two or three months. Awesome. Um, I've been hearing more and more about stay out of debt and everything like that. And I've been slowly adopting that idea into my mind. Now I know that you mentioned about paying off debt, except the house for a while. If the goal is to get out of debt, mind you, I'm not a homeowner, but if the goal is to get out of debt, why save up for a down payment on a house to get into debt for a home? And if you are to get into debt to get a home, how do you do that without getting a credit score or anything like that? Uh, great question, man. I like the way you're thinking already two, three months into the game. Uh, man, well, welcome to the team. And uh, hopefully you, you can adopt all the way into the game. Uh, but to answer your first part of your question, uh, why do we suggest that you have a down payment to get back into debt? Uh, our suggestion is not for you to jump back into debt. Our number one suggestion is if you could pay cash for your mortgage, pay cash for it. That is the best and our preferred option. But we do understand that the average person in America is not going to save up four, five, six hundred thousand dollars to purchase a home. And so we believe that is OK to purchase a home because for the most part, that is an asset. And so we also want you to get into that very, very uh, wisely so you can get out of it very quickly. So you save to put 10 to 20 percent down finances over 15 years and then boom, because we've also learned that the average millionaire person who has a net worth of a million dollars or more pays off their home mortgage within a matter of 11 years. So when you get that 15 year fixed rate mortgage, more than likely you'll pay that thing off in between seven and 11 years. So then on the flip side, if you have no debt like myself and like John and like the other personalities that we have here, how do you get a, you know, how do you get a mortgage without um, actually having any, any debt? Great question. This is called uh, manual underwriting. Uh, we fully endorse and I personally use them uh, myself um, and they're called Churchill Mortgage. So they don't really go by my credit score. They go by, you know, did I pay my last mortgage on time? Did I pay my rent on time if I was renting? They will ask you to bring in your electricity bill. They will ask you to bring in stuff and they will manually underwrite you and look at your your situation. So and it's not in Churchill Mortgage is the one who we prefer. Now, there are several others out there who do manual underwriting. So that's not just one particular bank. Um, there are banks out there who do it. But Churchill, from our study and our relationship over the last few years, uh, they're the best one to do it. So you can get a mortgage without having debt. A mortgage still is debt. Let me be real with you. A mortgage is still debt. But that is one debt that we are OK with um, our our team, our tribe, um, our followers and our, our loved ones to have. Uh, because if they do it our way the average person will get out of it within between seven and 11 years. Make sense? Adam, you still there? Good man. Well, we lost him. That's all right. All right. Let's go out to, let me ask you this. Um, Adam, you still there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay. Oh, there okay, we go. Cool. Sorry. Great. So did, did that make sense? Yeah, it did make sense. And I, I was just curious because I've, been personally burned figuratively by debt and um you want to stay away with her as much as as much as possible so hence hence the question good for you yeah i mean and yeah. I'll, I'll tell you this adam i just took out a mortgage i've been renting i haven't owed anybody money in years and i just took out a mortgage and it already is hanging on me i've already had a gotcha. meeting with my boss here to how can we accelerate so, i mean it's already weighing on me and so it's not debt that we love in fact, we hate it. Mm -hmm. It's something that we tolerate just because of, of <laughs> how hard it is to save up for that long to, to pay cash for a house. Yeah. So it's not preferable, gotcha. um, but it's the only one we'll tolerate. And it's even that, it's with, with a really wrinkled up face, right? Yeah. It has the key word, tolerate. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. I appreciate your call. And man, welcome aboard, like Anthony said.